Welcome to the Doctor to Doctor homepage. Here you can send and receive messages and organize your secure conversations. In Doctor to Doctor, you receive messages in a mailbox in the same way that in your email you receive messages in your inbox. However, unlike your email inbox, which only you can access, mailboxes can be accessed by a combination of users. If we go to the connections page, we'll see that Dr. Clark Bonner, for example, has both a general clinic mailbox that he and another member of his staff have access to, and a private mailbox that only he can access. On the home page, in the left panel, you can access your mailboxes and their folders. In the central panel, you can access all the conversations within the folder that you've selected. In the right panel, you can read and respond to the conversation that you've selected in the central panel. To send a new message, click the green button. Today, we're going to ask Dr. Neil Merritt, a urologist, about wait times in his clinic. Address your new conversation to Neil Merritt's mailbox. You can select the mailbox from the ones that you've contacted recently or marked as a favorite. If you don't know the name of the mailbox that you want to contact, you can search through the doctors and clinics in the address book. Select the mailbox and write your message. You can add a patient or any attachments And if you'd like to see when someone has read your message, you can require a read receipt. Select the folder in your mailbox that you'd like the message to appear in, and whether or not the message is urgent. You'll be notified of any incoming messages in the site in the notifications area and in the panel to the left. From the notifications area, you can click on the notification to go to the conversation. If you receive a message while you are not logged into the site, you can customize notifications to be delivered to you via email or text message or both. In each conversation, there is a list of users involved in the conversation at the top. Green indicates that they are online, red that they are offline. Messages that have been sent or received appear in the middle along with the name of the mailbox and the user in the mailbox and a timestamp. You can respond to your message and add any important patient demographics to the conversation. You can also attach any documents. If you have any questions, please do not hesitate to explore the help page or email or call support.